you will frequently need to format output so that it is in a currency or similar format where you have commas and dollar signs and decimal points and you should be pretty comfortable with this because you're going to do it in probably half of the assignments. So when you're adding it to a print statement, you'll print whatever your text is, and the dollar sign is going to need to come at the end of your text statement before your quotes. And then to format a variable, or this could be actual numbers, you type in format, and then in parentheses you put the variable or number that you're going to format, a comma, and then the formatting pattern. For currency, the formatting pattern is going to be comma, which puts the commas at the every three places point where we're seeing here. We want it to only have two numbers to the right of the decimal point, so that what is what that means. So it's a float with two numbers after the decimal point, and it's using comma formatting. To put the dollar sign in, you have to do that on your own. But that's how you'll format things for currency, and you're expected to do that in many programs for this course.